Well, look what made it into the yard this week. It's like someone scrapped the 1982 Ford Mustang GT. Along with its brother. One of its brothers. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's check it out, man. All the Ford lovers out there. In particular, Fox Body Mustang guys. Four lugs. Let's take a look at this one over here first. Pretty stripped out. It's a dual uh, that snorkel. Uh, what do you call it? The uh, the air cleaner there with the dual dual deals there. I know that there's some people are looking for those. That was actually on that car over there. I don't want to hear this one here because you got a bin on that. Pretty stripped out. Pretty stripped out. So they've done some work. Look at that brand new drums on it. On this rear end. Might have new axles on it. I don't know. It looks like it might have new studs. I don't know. I turned it and well I can't do it now, but I did turn it. And it is a uh, I think it's like a they call it yeah, they both spin in the same direction. I know they're not called posies on a Ford. Track lock is it? What is it? Battery box bolted down here. Yeah. All right, man. Enough with this. Just enough with this one. Oh, yeah. Let's check this one out, though. Fairly straight car. a matching set of wheels oh, I think the other one might no yeah I think it's in the back back there the other one of those damage there that's like an old that's old damage right there that wasn't done recently that was in the yard that might have been though forklifts might have put it back here yeah it's got some dents in it. That scoop still looks okay. Let's take a look under the hood, man. I got here yesterday. I wish I would have been here. Got here earlier, earlier during the week, cause I can open this damn thing. Where is it? Oh, it's on this side. Yeah, when I got here yesterday, a dude was a. Uh, is the under the hood he ended up taking the heads and the intake I don't blame him on the intake it was an Edelbrock yeah it's sitting on the, in the bed of that truck right there so. I'm not sure what else oh yeah he also took the lid off the air cleaner it said no 5.0 HO. I think it said high output or something. Yeah. Like I said, this is damaged down here. I just put that there because. This is a striker deal there, so it doesn't stay closed. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Here's the original. I'm assuming the original intake carb is out of the wheel. Yep. <clears throat> 
Let's take a look underneath real quick. Oh, I can't really see much from here. Let's see where I can go on this side. Fender's catching it. Tara's got some decent parts in it, though, man. Let's go on the other side. thing I, I saw it yeah looks like you know, one of the previous owners had a 71 Econoline line van needed too much thing there's the vent on it but um yeah one thing i noticed on this car is uh that dash is not even cracked at least i didn't really notice anything it's a little warped maybe a little right here in this area but it might, they might have replaced this one though. Who knows? It looks like there's missing holes up there. So they may have replaced this dash. It may have been a new one at one point. Maybe not. Yeah. Like I say, it's all, all in all in terrible shape. It's inside here. Nothing. Steering wheel, it's worn. Yeah. But this, I was looking at this center console and it looks to be in pretty decent shape actually. I don't see it cracked anywhere. I don't think that's a crack, I think that's the way it was made. Yeah. Yeah, end up breaking this deal off. Yeah, I think she was like a this is a brown and black interior. They replaced the they replaced the carpet. Yeah, man. There it is. There it is. <laughs> How many of uh, these Mustangs end up uh, making it into the yard? At least not complete like this one. Yep. There's another one over there. 80... I don't know. It's mid-80s. There's another one. Let's check that one out. All right.